what's right and take the time to explain it to you than to do what others do, which is just to vote along party lines. This is what this vote is about. Okay, remember the thing when I come from the military just last year, I come from a very, I think, common sensical perspective. Across all the marriage, on the issue of organization, on unionization, it goes like this. You go into an, uh, into an outfit and you vote. Whoever gets the most votes, that's what decides the issue. But not for FAA. Not, not for, not for, they had a special set aside that went like this, sir. You, you may be surprised, but I'm about ready to tell you. Let's say there's 3,000 people in the organization, okay? 3,000 people, and let's say 2,000 of them show up to vote. If 1,400 of them show up to vote to unionize, and 600 of them show up to vote and say no, what do you think the American way is? 1,400 show up and say that based on conditions, they want to, they want to unionize. 600 say, no, we don't want to unionize. What do you think the American way is? Should they be able to unionize? Yes. That bill was wrong. That bill said that you don't get to unionize with 1,400 votes. That, vote, that bill was about upholding 1,501 as the answer because you count the not votes as not unionized. To me, that's wrong. Look, here's the thing. This is an intensely personal choice as to whether or not to unionize. You know, if you want to unionize, vote yes. If you don't want to unionize, vote no. If you really don't want to unionize, get all your friends to vote no. But don't come to me to skew the rules. That's not right. They wanted me, my party wanted me to say, hey, just vote for this. You know, you, know, you don't want to have to go back home and explain uh, this vote. And I said, wait, hey, hold on a second, give me the details of that. And, and when I learned, I said, you're kidding me. You want me to vote for that? You want me to vote that if 1,400 people vote to unionize and 600 vote no, that the answer is no? I don't think that's right. And I'm certainly welcome to hear your points on that. I don't think that's right.